usually smells like for Jake. But don't worry, this sushi is made out of cake. Like my ass. Y'all, I could really go for a vegetable roll dipped in spicy mayonnaise and then stuffed up my asshole. <laughs> y'all, hello motherfuckers, how are you today? So today is my second DIY ever and y'all, I have a treat for you. Before we get started, don't forget to subscribe to this channel to become a tomato. We're trying to reach 300,000 tomatoes and it would literally make my clit just like dance. If I hit that goal, it would, it would just, it would ballroom dance the salsa. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you can watch all my future videos. Today I am making sushi cake pops. Y'all, it's like made out of cake, but it looks like sushi. You feel me? Now this DIY turned out a little ratchet. <laughs> I had some technical difficulties. You will see that in the DIY. You know, in the end, it all turned out pretty decent. I'm happy with it. Anyways, enjoy this DIY. <laughs> this is great for parties and friends and, um, you know, like stuffing your fucking face with. So, enjoy. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So here's how to make adorable sushi cake pops that are so cute. Like if a person was this cute, they would be getting so much dick. Y'all, you will need a pre-made cake. I bought mine from the store, to be honest. It looks like a vagina, a swollen one, and some chocolate sprinkles, and some sweetened coconut flakes, frosting, any kind you would prefer, white chocolate chips or milk chocolate, whatever you prefer, candy, whatever you fucking prefer, and straws, but only get straws if there's no lollipop sticks at the store. Okay, so get your bowl and put your swollen vagina in it. <laughs> um, and then just kind of squish it up, make it into crumbs. Crumble that shit until it's like dust, like dustier than your grandparents' shit. Like honestly, I don't even think old people shit. I just think dust pops out. Take your frosting and put it in your crumbs and start mixing it with a spoon, but then stop giving a fuck and use your damn hands like an animal, like we were meant to use in the caveman days. Then add a little more if it's dry and keep mixing it with your hands until it's like a dough ball. That dough ball dough, <laughs> take a plate and start forming it into the shape of um, a cucumber or, you know, a penis or a sushi roll because that's what we're aiming for. You can make it small, big, thick, skinny, curved. <laughs> So now we're gonna put our sushi roll in the fridge and we're gonna take our white chocolate, put it in a bowl and melt it for 30 seconds at a time in the microwave because you do not want this to burn. If you burn it, I will fart in your mouth. So this is where shit hit the fan. I laid out my chocolate sprinkles. I thought that I would just dunk my dick shaped sushi roll into chocolate and then roll it nicely into sprinkles and it would come out looking nice. But that's not what happened, y'all. Dear God, y'all. Oh my God, it looks like shit. I was panicking at this point. I was sweating. I was near tears. <laughs> I was like, why God? Why this sushi roll? I was about to post a picture on Facebook of it that says one like one prayer, but then I was like, no. Instead, I just punished it by letting it sit with its ugly self in self-pity. So now after the chocolate's kind of hard, we're gonna cut it into little sushi pieces and we are going to take our straws. If you have lollipop sticks, use them. These straws were shit, but I did not find them at my local store. So, you know, that's how life is. You don't always get what you want. So I'm trying to make them stand up in this little box I made, but <laughs> they're all bending. I had a mini meltdown here. It was all falling apart. Okay, okay. Fuck this, fuck this. Fuck this all. Fuck it all. That was actual footage of me getting angry at life itself. So now we're gonna take Twizzlers to act as our little fish. So I cut off little pieces. And now an airhead for the avocado, cause sushi is always so good with avocado. I had to get little green things. And then an orange starburst for the carrot. I just ripped off a chunk. So now we're gonna decorate it. And at this point, things were looking up. I was so happy. I felt like Jesus was finally saving my soul. So I put some more white chocolate, dunked it in my coconut. So it looks like rice. And it really looked like rice. I was so proud of myself. And now we're gonna dip our little candy pieces into more white chocolate, stick that shit on there, and just make it look fucking cute. Do whatever you gotta do to make it look appetizing and sexy and make bitches wanna rub it on their fucking nipple. Oh, yeah, thanks, daddy. <laughs> but also just make it look really adorable and just make it you. Like, be yourself and always believe in yourself and, you know, hashtag be any sushi you wanna be. So then I tasted it and it tasted like one of those coconut Girl Scout cookies. It tasted amazing. I ate that whole damn thing. And then I spit out half of it because bitches on a diet. I'm sorry. But I'm still dancing. So, 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 shake off the man tits. So. Thank you guys so much for watching this DIY. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe to become a red juicy tomato. Um, You won't regret it. I hope not. And I'll, <laughs> I will see you guys next video. I love you so much. Ooh, ooh, ooh.